What is up everybody and welcome to a brand new vlog and today we are on an absolute mission because of the heat my camera on my iPhone for some reason just sometimes doesn't want to work and also the battery of my iPhone can't stand the amount of recording we do so we're on a mission we need to find a DJI Osmo Pocket 3 camera which has a big sensor inside and we're going to be able to record videos at nighttime with quite some good quality now the problem is they are sold out everywhere in Pattaya and basically pretty much all around the world and only some private people have it and in Pattaya there's zero of them people so today it is already nearly two but it seems like we will have to go to Bangkok to acquire a camera and maybe even get to visit the Roti lady you have all been talking about but first I need to exchange some money for the worst financial decision of this year to buy that camera but I really hope it's gonna help out the channel and also the biggest reason is when I record with my phone it's really big so when I'm inside somewhere Thai people are like no stop recording with a small camera like that you don't even notice it so it's gonna be stealth video anyways let's go exchange some money just exchange some money now if you guys don't know where to change your money in Pattaya the best currency rates are over at TT exchange so remember that if you ever go to Pattaya TT exchange it's yellow booths with exchanges but you got to make sure that it says TT exchange has the best rates in Pattaya I think well guys we have ordered a taxi to go over to Bangkok to get the camera that we need so off we go you might be wondering why didn't we go on a bus first of all because we have no time to go on a bus it takes absolute ages and second of all it's just a few dollars more expensive if two of you are going so we're taking this car Evelina says that is beautiful right now outside and here is our car so here we are we're driving an MG electric car over to Bangkok so that's gonna be quite interesting electric car Wow, you can see MG everywhere you can see the battery power right here and if you get a bit too hot you can get some fans inside very nice it's raining outside nothing better than some tropical rain it must be really really warm have arrived over to Bangkok and right now we're going to a shopping mall where there's a guy waiting for me at KFC so that I can acquire the camera that is very hard to find nowadays so I'm trying to find KFC right now this is one heck of a sketchy deal buying one of them cameras in KFC in Bangkok let's see how it works out we got to find KFC here in the first place somewhere on the ground floor one of the Thai guys told me oh it's very low here now all I gotta do is find KFC oh, where the heck is KFC so guys got myself a DJI Osmo Pocket 3 in a KFC in Bangkok so let's see how it is well guys it seems like I've got this thing now and now we're no longer spotable by anybody so now we could be in disguise and nobody will find out what the heck are we doing right now so that's actually quite good now all I gotta do is find Evelina because this place she walked in and she saw all the stuff that has been long sanctioned in Russia and she's amazed at it so let's go and check it out I have no idea how to use this camera yet but I gotta tell you one thing it's definitely a great little small camera that we're gonna be using in the vlogs 
checking out what the people are up to. Uh, all I have to do is just figure out how to use this thing. I think that Evelina is over at that Sephora store. So we're gonna go and check it out and see what's going on there. Guys, I think I'm gonna be stuck in Bangkok because for Evelina, this is like a dream come true, seeing all this stuff that she has missed for such a long time. And I could already see her. She's just looking at everything, just staring at everything. So let's go and check it out. You could see Evelina right here, founding everything that she <laughs> always wanted to get. Look at the selection of stuff here. Wow. I'm gonna go broke, I think. Definitely going broke after this trip, because you know what? The financial, the financial decisions here are bad. Let's hope that with this camera now, we're gonna get some content. And I already see that nobody's noticing me speaking to myself like an absolute psycho. So that's good. And nobody's coming and saying no cameras because it's so tiny. Look at happy Evelina testing every single cosmetic there is possible to test out i gotta tell you guys this store is huge so we're here for a very long time i don't know when we're gonna be leaving this place somebody please save me i'm actually being held hostage at this store right here we finally got out of that place it took us absolutely ages now it's time to get a bit of food because the only food we had was like three or four hours ago. So let's go and explore a bit of food here. You know what? I don't know for sure yet if we're gonna see the Roti lady today because some of you have said that I have to like check out if she has a live stream on and stuff like that. I'll do a bit of research. Maybe we'll see her today. Maybe we won't. But first, I'm starving. Wow, guys, I know we're not on the streets right now or anything like that. But look at the little cafes they got here in this shopping mall. This is so nice. Wow, you could see people enjoying a bit of sushi. Wow, very nice. This definitely looks way nicer than the stuff in Pattaya. And we are now wondering why did we not go to Bangkok? But I guess we'll have to explore here a bit more some other time. So I don't know. Maybe we'll end up in Bangkok one day. You never know. We have found some sort of a restaurant here where there's a lot of people in a huge queue. So we thought, why not try it out? So guys, we have been put into queue right now. So we're gonna be waiting our turn to go inside into this little cafe in the shopping mall, which is ultra popular with a lot of people. Oh, thank you. Ultra popular because it's full and packed, the only place. So we might as well try it out and it is some Korean food. Evelina is showing a piece of paper. I don't know why, but we can look at Evelina. Let's look at Evelina. What is she doing? Oh, oh, what, what, how, how do I control this? I have absolutely no idea. Oh, you can zoom in. Wow, amazing, absolutely amazing. How amazing is that? Okay guys, I need to figure this camera out because this camera is amazing, has a lot of features, has a gimbal, has all the things I need. And it came with this DJI microphone as well, which I think sounds way better than the microphones I had because the actual receiver of this camera is really good. And I don't have to waste my phone battery anymore and my phone battery died very quickly, so it was very hard to record longer videos. So now I could do all of that with the size of my knuckle. The camera is literally the size of my knuckle, so nobody really sees it. At nighttime, I really wanna test it out and see how good it is. So tell me guys, how's the quality? Is it better than the iPhone one? Is it the same? You tell me. Oh, looks like we got our cue. Very good sitting down in this place oh i gotta tell you guys this is a tight fit inside so let's see what they got here so what do we have in the menu we got a lot of boneless breasts 
boneless thighs it seems like there's a lot and a lot of different stuff in the menu that looks nice but i saw some people eating some ramen and i want some of that stuff it is a bit more expensive than the usual places but this place looks so popular that we really wanted to try it out so let's see if it's any good oh you got some tofu soup kimchi jigai whatever the heck that is you have no idea but we gotta find something to eat right now and i don't know what so got some chicken some rice some punch and i'm also gonna get some ramen as well because this is for me and evelina so let's try this out okay so it is time to try out this chicken and see how good it is evelina says it's good we got Evelyn said this is better than KFC. We're gonna try with some garlic sauce straight up. See, it looks rather nice. Wow, camera, why are you focusing on that lady? No, focus on me. Focus on me. The chicken has destroyed. Oh, sorry, can I have uh, this? And uh, can you make spicy? More spice, more spicy. Okay. Thank you. Well, let's see how good it is. Guys, you can't imagine how tasty this is. This is so good. Oh my lord. Evelina got some dish called kimchi rice cheese volcano. So we're gonna see if it's any good either as well. Cause I don't know. And I got myself some ramen. And then we're gonna go explore a little bit of Bangkok. And then at nighttime, hopefully there's not gonna be any traffic and we'll get back to our home and to our cats. Evelina got something serious. She's got the cheese kimchi rice. Looks like Evelina is really enjoying a bit of food. Very nice. It's not delicious. Evelina said that she doesn't like this at all whatsoever. I guess I gotta try it out now. Okay, you know what? Seems like I'm gonna be trying out the flipping cheese part of this and see what Evelina was saying. Was she lying to us or was she being honest with us? It was actually really good. And Evelina said that you gotta mix it up with a bit of omelet and then it ends up tasting very good. Look at that. Pretty good. Oh, wow. Thank you. Oh, the smokes, guys. I've got a ramen right here and to be honest with you I'm quite full so I don't know how I am gonna be eating it I honestly don't know how I am gonna eat this this is actually quite a big dish but you know what it looks nice it smells peppery so let's see if it's any good to the taste okay I guess we start with a new I wish I got chopsticks I guess no chopsticks for me so I guess I'll be having it like this Ooh, that's hot. That is piping hot. What can I say, guys? I gotta try the actual soup. You know, I don't know. It's not that bad, you know, but that soup for 40 baht in Jam Kian at nighttime, it beats this any day. Let's try out the sausage at, at least. See if it's any good. Smoky sausage. Not that bad. You get an enjoyment out of that, but that 40 bath soup in Jam Tien Beach, nothing can ever, ever beat that thing. Well, I'll be honest with you guys, I was not the biggest fan of that place where we were in just a second ago. Second of all, what I noticed is that in Thailand, it seems like Nobody really uses tap to pay on their phone. Does anybody have an explanation why? It feels, it baffles me because I remember when I used to be in Russia, everybody before the sanctions used to pay by tapping their phone to the card machine and that's it. I don't know what's happening. Kind of weird considering how some, how it is sometimes so technologically advanced. You know, feels a bit weird. But anyways, 
I have no idea what we're gonna be doing right now, so we need to figure something out. Guys, I actually feel so sick after having that food in that Korean restaurant. Yeah, I think it's easier to get poisoned probably in a shopping mall cafe rather than one of them on the streets. And you know what? We have decided where we're gonna be <clears throat> checking out <clears throat> the Roti Lady in Bangkok. So, <clears throat> oh my God, I got like Kim Chin stuck in my throat or something. Anyways, we're gonna check her out and see how it looks like and taste her famous Roti pancakes. I think that's gonna be cool. How could you come to Bangkok and not try what all of you guys have been asking me to do, try out the pancakes in the Roti Lady place. So that's exactly what we're gonna be doing. Guys, look what Evelina has found. She went into the bathroom and she had a lifetime experience witnessing two bathrooms at the same time. Would you just look at that? We could have went together and had some very romantic toilet time together. Anyways, let's go. We just ordered a taxi cab because we have no idea how to get around Bangkok. But we need to get to the Roti Lady of Bangkok. She works until 10 p.m. and right now it's 9.14 so hopefully we make it in time. Our taxi driver is supposed to be here in two minutes, hopefully. And the drive over takes like 10 or 15 minutes. If we don't catch her, that's going to be one of the biggest disappointments ever. So let's hope that we catch the Roti lady today. That would be awesome. Try the pancakes after that horrible meal. You know what? It, it, that, that ramen thing that I ate, I just feel awful after it. So let's hope that we make it so that we can make up to this. Now, this is not our last time we're coming to Bangkok. We're gonna be exploring Bangkok more thoroughly, but because of the camera I'm recording in right now, it's so scarce right now, and it's out of stock in every single store all around the world, basically. We had to go jump in a cab and drive down to Bangkok so that we can get it. You know, it's very stealthy. Nobody even notices it, so it's great. I love it. And the quality, I think, it's amazing as well. The sensor is better, and we're gonna see how it does at nighttime because right now you could see behind me it is quite dark and when we get to the roti lady we're gonna see how the camera performs very very interesting oh here's our cab hello time to go and try out the famous pancake we should be there in 10 15 minutes so let's hope we are able to catch up in time to try it out it's gonna be quite funny i think so we have made it over where the roti woman works at so let's go and find her somewhere here you see some people eating here and i think yeah this is the roti lady right here you've been all asking me to come here hello oh Everybody asked me to come to you to try your pancake. Uh -huh. <laughs> Can you make uh, for her with this and no egg? Just banana? No, no banana, just that. Just cut that meal? Yes, yes, yes. And for me, uh, no banana, just chocolate. Thank you. So here we are, trying out the famous roti right here. You guys all have been asking for this. So here we are. We drove literally to Bangkok to buy the camera and to have those pancakes. What could be better? Oh, this is nice. Guys, I don't know why the pancakes are not square, but... Oh, we want to have now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, let's try it out. Mm. Thank you. Thank you very much. Guys, first of all, as much as I can say right now, and as much as I wanted to try out the famous Roti pancakes, I could tell you one thing, guys. I got her hair in my mouth. 
and that is not nice. About the pancake itself, you know what? I've eaten better pancakes. I actually, to be honest with you, don't know what the hype is about. Maybe the pancakes aren't just as good in Bangkok like they are in Pattaya. Тебе не нравится? Это не вкусно. Во-первых, тесто сырое, и но это не вкусно. Я беру постоянно этот блин роти у других, и там прям он офигенный такой хрустящий. Yeah, we usually get like a bunch of roti pancakes from all around the place in Pattaya and I've definitely eaten much better. I mean, it's consumable, but I don't know what the hype is about. Guys, I gotta show you some real good places. I gotta be honest, I gotta show you some better places than this. I'll be honest with you, there's way, way better places. I think this place is just a bit overhyped. And the taste of oil is just kind of like old oil or something. I don't know. I don't even know how to explain this, guys, but this is just not that good. I don't know if I want to finish this because it's just, you know, it's fine, but I guess I'll finish it just not to waste the food, but it is what it is. Guys, hopefully I don't get attacked by the rats. A rat right here. I don't know if you could see. Probably not. But there's a bunch of rats just running around the place they're encaged you could see one from the top very hard to see but there is a rat there's like three rats in there wow i've not seen so many rats in one place in my life this is something definitely new i've never seen three flipping rats in one place and one of them was literally cleaning itself what the heck is going on evelina said she liked the smell of soup Let's chicken noodle, see. chicken rice. Oh, very nice. Oh, no. I guess, you know what? Evelyn is now scared of eating anything in Bangkok because she didn't have a ex pleasant experience either at the shopping mall or over at the Roti Lady. I don't know. But that wasn't just that good whatsoever. Anyways, we're gonna order a taxi right now and get ourselves back to Pattaya to our cats because it is getting quite late. So let's order a taxi right now. Wow, the 7-Elevens are tiny here. Literally, it's hard to get through. Ice machine broken as usual. I have no idea where we are in Bangkok right now, but this place is sketchy. That's the first feeling that I get right now anyways, but rather than that, people are just doing their own thing. You could see some trash here. You know, because the trash bins are too small, people walking around the place. This is a city, a big, big, huge city with trains, I'm guessing, on top or roads. I don't know. Evelina just found some kosher food and she said we should have ate there instead of that nasty Korean place. We, I like Korean places, just that place, you know, after, it doesn't feel that good. It doesn't feel that good. So I have to be curing myself and I'm drinking a bit of Coca-Cola. Although in Pattaya, I actually didn't want none of that. You could also see a barber right here getting some haircuts. Very nice. Wow, this is, this is a me me megapolis right here, straight up. And a bunch of tuk-tuks. Evelina found some sort of a store right here that she really wanted to go in. Oh, this is really colorful and cool. I like this. I'm guessing it just sells a bunch of masks for beautifulness and all sorts of stuff. I much prefer an electric store, but this looks like, Evelina says, Korean cosmetics, Chinese cosmetics, basically a store with a bunch of Asian cosmetics and stuff like that. For example, if you're feeling like a samurai in the morning, you could get yourself some samurai blades. Evelina was hungry, so we got a Big Mac for her over at McDonald's because she really did not like the food over at that Korean place. So she didn't even finish her rice because, like she said, it tasted like a wet, old, moist towel that was in a fridge. You know that smell that some fridges make? Like that. So she didn't really enjoy it. She didn't finish it. So we went to McDonald's and we're gonna walk around the streets a bit more, explore it and see a bit of Bangkok 
at night time and then maybe at 11 or 12 we'll order ourselves a taxi and go back to Patai. Right now it's 10.14 and we are in McDonald's. No, thank you. Well, I really thought this was only in Pattaya, but we are offered all sorts of shows, like ping pong shows, but they are not playing with paddles, all right? So, wow. Not only in Pattaya, on Walking Street, you get offered, but also on some random street in Bangkok. Wow. <laughs> you have everything. Yeah. Gartier. Wow! Look at this. Very look at, nice. Look at me. Very nice. Yes, you're the best. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Look at it. Why buy the real one, right? You can go here and get yourself some nice Rolex. Real one, my friend. Fast copy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but this is good. Have a good night, my friend. Can get yourself all sorts of Rolexes. Now, a lot of people were telling me in one of the videos, like. When I was joking around about the, um, what you call it, about why would you buy a real Rolex when you can buy a fake one, I was kidding. Why are you like, obviously a fake watch is not gonna work that way. Instead of buying a fake one, you could just buy yourself a good real one, but like a Seiko or a Casio or something like that. All sorts of foods here. Hello. Oh, very nice. Well, we're in some food port right now. We're just full of food right now, and it is just, wow. I wish we didn't eat there. I wish we should have eaten here. So, we got our car over to Pattaya. Let's go. Hello. Yes, Ivan. Now it's time to go back to Pattaya. Very nice. Nice and chilly in the car. This is sweet for a price of like $25 to go back 120 kilometers. Look at this swaggy Jeep. Nice. After that two hour drive, we finally have arrived back to our complex. It is currently 1 a.m. and I still got to edit this video and post it out for you guys. So it seems like I'm not going to be getting a lot of sleep today, but I enjoy making videos for you guys. So nothing better than a bit of editing, uploading, and I really hope that soon they will actually put the internet inside of our apartment because it's really annoying going downstairs to upload videos in the middle of the night. It's much better doing it inside of the apartment. Well, finally back home with the cats. Here's Ponchik for you, saying hello to all of you. Say hello, Ponchik. Uh, that's his way of saying hello, I guess. Right, Pichenka? Well guys, thank you very much for watching this video. I really appreciate your support, your comments, your likes, your subscriptions. You guys are the best and I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. Hopefully it wasn't too boring. We actually ended up checking out the Roti Lady and to my surprise it wasn't as good as everybody had said it is. Now guys, see you later guys, have a great evening, I'm literally brain dead right now, I don't know what I'm saying, and I gotta edit this video right now, so I'll see you next time, have a good one.